Hello everybody, this is uh, Dr. Chuck. I want to show you a little gadget I just created. Um, it's uh, time to teach classes and I'm, a, I'm a trying out uh, Canvas because the University of Michigan is piloting Canvas along of course with C Tools, which is Sakai, but um, I didn't, I'm tired of typing my quiz questions into every dang LMS um, and, then, and then having to type them in again and the exports don't work so well and I want the quiz questions to belong to me. So I was looking for a format. I was going to invent a format and I came across this really cool format called the GIF format from the, I think it was invented by the Moodle community. It's a micro format. Um, it's a micro format. It's an officially registered micro format and it's really quite cool. Um, you know, it, it basically gives the question text, the question name, the question text, the answers, that's a true false. This is a fill in the blank. Those are the two right answers. And um, this is a multiple choice. Now, I love it, right? This is multiple choice of feedback. It's just amazing. And so these are right, wrong, and feedback. And, and so it's sort of imagining for me all the user interface of add a question, add an option. I'm like, oh, and I want to share these things with people and I want others to edit my questions. And so this is like the simplest format. But the problem is, is that I need it. I, I can't import that. I need to import QTI format. So I have built this project. It's called the gift to QTI formatter uh, converter. And it basically you paste the gift in. Here's the sample gift from that Moodle Docs page. And um, later this might get better. But basically, because um, it only really, my code only does three of the many different kind of GIFT formats. But I'll, I'll, it won't be hard. I just, I started working on this less than 24 hours before my first lecture this semester. So I could only do so much in the 24 hours. So I'll put in a quiz title, my first quiz. And, um... I'll just want my downloaded file called 01 quiz. Don't add a suffix to that. And I'm going to hit run the conversion. Now this conversion takes a while, eight or nine, 10 seconds. Somehow the XSD validation uh, takes a while. Um, this is telling you simply which ones of those questions weren't supported, short answers, multiple answers are not supported and numerical questions are not supported, which is okay, it just doesn't do it. You can take a look at the quiz XML. This is uh, QTI. If you look at the version up here, it's 1.2 um, or 1.2.1 actually version is what this is. But this isn't what anybody wants. It seems as though nobody's willing to import that XML. I, I got Samago inside of Sakai to X, import the XML. <clears throat> but everybody really wants this as a zip file. And what the zip file really is, the zip file really is, is um, it's a cute, it's an, a tiny little IMS common cartridge with just a quiz in it. And everyone seems to like that a lot better. So this got downloaded. So now I'm going to go into my uh, Coursera course. Hello, here's my course. I mean, not Coursera course. Canvas, Coursera, C-Tools, Sakai. I'm always confused. So I'm going to import into the course. And I'm going to, you can see that I failed as I was developing the code. And then things started working a lot better. Um, but let's do another one. Import QTI zip file. I will choose the file. I'll go into my downloads folder. That is the folder that I just got done downloading. Zippity doo dah. I'll stick these things in an unfiled question question bank. And then away I go. I'm importing it. And so now it takes a little while. It's checking and running and chugging along. Do, 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 do. And now it's completed. And if I go into my quizzes, here is my first quiz. That is the quiz that I built, that I just imported. And I can preview it. And you will see that the, it, it had a true-false. It has a um, uh, multiple choice and a this is an essay. So that's a pretty nice workflow, really quick workflow from GIF to QTI. I'll probably change some things. I may make this so it's got a URL that it can pull these things right out of GitHub. Who knows what I'm going to do with this next? This is just like 12 hours of coding. And uh, so uh, there we go. Um, if you want, 
you it's it's in github and i can go and it's sitting here in github gift to qti <clears throat> a gift to qti okay and it's my gift to qti 1.2 converter here's all the code um i did it in a hurry over about a seven eight hour period and uh so um, i'll clean it up but i just wanted to show it to you so uh thanks a lot and uh, thanks for listening